You are now watching Tales from the Grid. The Megazord comes in at two feet tall, which is about the height of two legacy Megazords or about four Lightning Collection figures. This Megazord is opposable and can disassemble into the five Dinozords. The Megazord also features LED lighting effects in the eyes of the Dinozords. The parts to build this Megazord comes in different stages along with assembly guides to help customers build. The free gifts for this subscription includes a mug, shirt, battery pack, LED base, book bag, and seven power coins. There are two plans to get the Megazord, the 22 month and the 12 month. Based on these plans, there are a total of 120 assembly stages sent in 22 or 12 monthly packages. There is no option to receive all the packages at once. For the most part, customers will pay for each stage along with shipping and tax. The 22 month plans come out to over $2,000 before taxes. The 12 month plan comes out to almost $1,800 before taxes. The free gifts don't start coming until the fourth and third months, and the gifts are spread throughout the subscription. The LED base is also sent in parts. In other countries, the free gifts included posters and an assembly guide storage box. Other countries have received physical copies of the assembly guides and a free storage box as a gift to store them. The U.S. will only be receiving digital copies of the guides with no option to get physical ones. Customers aren't able to download the guides until they receive the stage for it. This Megazord finally got a U.S. release and will be cheaper to obtain than via imports. The size of this Megazord will definitely make it a standout in your collection. This Megazord is opposable and can disassemble despite its size. This Megazord is made with die-cast metal, which improves the quality. Customers have a choice of two different purchase plans. The U.S. release only gets six free gifts, while other countries got as much as eight. Out of the six free gifts, only the LED base and the power coins seem worthwhile, whereas the other free gifts are generic items with MMPR logos slapped onto them. The free gifts aren't really free, as the total cost of this Megazord most likely has their price baked in. The staggered releases of the parts seems to be shady and confusing, which makes it look like the company is being deceptive. The pricing scheme comes off as deceptive as well because the company's website says it charges shipping per assembly stage but sends the stages in monthly packages. There's no option to buy all the parts at once. The U.S. release doesn't get physical copies of the assembly guides and there's no option to buy it separately. Making the purchase option a monthly subscription can get more customers on board and give them time to collect funds to keep up the subscription. Adding free gifts to the subscription is a way to entice customers to stay longer and to make the total cost seem more justifiable. Not including physical copies of the assembly guide saves money on manufacturing and shipping. Making the first and second month subscription price low can draw in more customers. The subscription model could be more profitable than selling all the parts at once because customers who cannot afford the total purchase are more likely to attempt the subscription. Even if they cancel later on, the company will get some money which is better than no money at all. I'm glad this Megazord got a U.S. release because getting it imported via third party was too expensive. The subscription model won't seem worth it until you start getting the bulk packages. Not getting the physical copies of the assembly guides is BS. I'd rather have the assembly guides than the mug, shirt, and book bag. It would have been nice to have a faster way to get all the parts. Will I buy? Yes. Thank you for watching another episode of Tales from the Grid, and until next time, have a good one. <laughs>